Hello students, now let us learn the methods to solve linear equations in two variables. Let us start with the first method that is elimination method and the first type that is elimination by equating the coefficients. Uh, let's do a bit of quick revision of what you have done in your 9th standard. The sum is x minus y is equal to 7 and x plus y is equal to 11. Now what is this method of elimination by equating the coefficients? In this method, the first thing which is required is the given equation should be in the form of variables on one side and the constant on the other side. So both the variables that is x and y should be on the left hand side and the constant should be on the right hand side in this form. And remember the variables should always be in the alphabetical order. First you need to write the variable x then the variable y is equal to the constant term. Now once you get the equation in the required form, you need to number this equation as equation number 1 and this is how you number the equation inside a bracket, right? Similarly look at the second equation, the second equation is x plus y is equal to 11. It is absolutely in the required form where variables are on one side, the constant is on the other side and it is in the alphabetical order. So let this be equation number 2. Now what is this method all about? Elimination by equating the coefficients. Now see, when we say elimination, meaning we need to eliminate something. Eliminate what? Eliminate one of the two variables. So you need to either eliminate x or you need to eliminate y. Why to eliminate? See, when we eliminate y, we are left only with x and you directly get the value of x. Similarly, if you eliminate x, we are left with y and you directly get the value of y, right? So we need to eliminate one of the two variables so that you get the value of the other variable, right? Now the question is, which variable is to be eliminated? How do we decide whether we need to eliminate x or we need to eliminate y? So we need to eliminate that variable whose coefficients are equal. So in both the equations, say in the first equation we have 2x, in the second equation also we have 2x. So 2x, 2x will get cancelled, it will get eliminated. So it is important that to eliminate a variable, we need to have their coefficients equal in both the equations. 2x, 2x gets cancelled, 2x, 3x doesn't get cancelled, right? So we need to eliminate that variable whose coefficients are equal. That's the reason elimination by equating the coefficients. And if the coefficients are not equal, make them equal, right? Now the question is how to eliminate. Now say if we decide we need to eliminate say y, okay? Now to eliminate a variable, we need to either add the two equations or we need to subtract the two equations. Now when to add and when to subtract? To eliminate a variable, we need to check the signs of that variable. Now for, for example here, look at the coefficients of x. The coefficients are same, so we can eliminate x, right? Look at the coefficients of y. The coefficients of y are also the same, so we can eliminate y as well, right? But to either eliminate x or y, we need to check their signs. Now look at the signs of x. Here it's a plus sign. Even here, it's a plus sign. So can we say to eliminate x, the signs are same and whenever the signs are same, we need to subtract the two equations. Remember this. Now look at the variable y, the signs of variable y. What is the sign here? Minus. What is the sign here? Plus. The signs are different and whenever the signs are different, we need to add. So remember this. To eliminate a variable, we need to either add the two equations or subtract the two equations. For that, we need to check the signs of the variable to be eliminated. So if the signs of the variable to be eliminated is same, the signs are same, we need to subtract. And if the signs are different, we need to add. Here if we eliminate y, the signs are different. So to eliminate y, we will have to add the two equations. So that's your equation 1, that's your equation 2, let's add. So simple, we need to eliminate one of the variables. Which variable whose coefficients are equal? How to eliminate either by adding or subtracting? When to add? 
when the signs are different when to subtract when the signs are same whose signs of the variable which is to be eliminated easy now let's add when you add minus y plus y gets cancelled so y gets eliminated so what remains now 2x is equal to 18 and because y got eliminated we can easily find the value of x that's 18 upon 2 so x is equal to 9 once you get the value of one of the variables now to find the value of the other variable you need to substitute this value in either of the two equations whichever you are comfortable with you can either substitute in the first equation or you can substitute in the second equation the choice is absolutely yours always select the simpler equation right like here you can always substitute x is equal to 9 in equation 2 because there is a plus sign so chances of you doing a silly error is less right substituting x is equal to 9 in equation 2 we get 9 plus y is equal to 11 so y is equal to 11 minus 9 therefore y is equal to 2 once you get x you get y just write the final answer in this way solution of the given simultaneous equations is x comma y which is equal to 9 comma 2 as simple as that.